Hey, what's up, everyone? It's Lightning Master Engine 23 here. Uh, we're back with another episode of Paper Mario Thoughts of Your Door. On the last episode, we got access to Hooktail's castle, and we decided to traverse a small portion of it. And on this episode, we're going to continue going through Hooktail's castle. And, okay, so, seems like we're going to go into this room right over here. Uh, oh. oh! Shoot! Why did I jump on it? I was stupid. Oh, that was stupid. I mean, why did I jump on it? Yeah, that did not do anything. Right, I'm gonna go camera. And I might as well just stop. Let's just, to, you know, just deflect what I should probably swap my card into Koops. I think we're gonna be using Koops a lot more. Just oh god. Oh, there we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, normal hammer. This is stylish. Get the stylish attack. I'm gonna use a power shell because why not? Ah, I didn't get the stylish. Oh well. Got 12 star points for that, so that's pretty good. Pretty good for a starter. All right. Oh, oh, and these things back. Oh, these things back here. Uh, you know, shine sprites. Uh, let me check how many do we have. Yep, we only have one. That is a shine sprite. Uh, these will be used, uh, to power up your partners later in the game, and I'm gonna go at you first. Now, basically what start, uh, what Shine Sprites do in this game, they allow you to power up your partners. But yeah. Well, we can't really do them anything right now, because we're in the middle of the chapter, but when we're done with it, we're... I'm gonna show off what's happening. What we can use these Shine Sprites on. And I think we can just use Stop Boss, because it's very really good. Eh, I think it's best stylish. Six star points. Not too bad. Not too shabby. And not using any FP or anything right now, because I kind of want to conserve a little bit of it, you know? Alright, now here we got a little bit of a puzzle. Now, here, now over here we got a little bit of a puzzle, so... We did not whack this block. Uh, so that we could get over here. We have to knock this. And then what we need to do is oh shoot um okay i have to send it this way so use coops to do this heal them in midair by holding x then do a little bit of parkour over here and then stand on this block and he'll be able to stand on the block hopefully i don't s i screwed up the jump okay. Okay, let's restart the algorithm this is gonna be a little bit tedious. Uh, so, um, yeah. Pretty much, that's kind of the entire premise of what you need to do. You repeat the process, and then I pretty much have to make this jump. Okay, there we go. Star piece! Now, star piece, we have four of these. These are used to buy certain uh, badges that you can get on the game. Also, what am I supposed to do? Oh, wait, I'm. S oh, wait, I'm kind of dumb. Oh, wait, I'm kind of dumb. Wait, there's a thing over here. Wait, there's a thing here. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, hold up. I see something over there. I'm gonna stand on this purple block. A little off over here. Ah, star piece. I don't think I encountered this swing on the first play on my first playthrough of this. Huh. That's interesting. But yeah, there's a key over here that we need to get to, but as far as we can tell, there's really nothing we can do. Let's, let's repeat the algorithm, and do this, go the Nintendo way, get this. There's a switch over there, but I don't know if we're supposed to do anything with it yet. What am I supposed to do here? Oh wait, I'm stupid. I have to knock this. Oh, I'm dumb. I am so stupid. Man, I could... I am stupid. Holy god. Then, to get the stairs back to work... Can I please get over here? Okay. Get the switch. Move the stairs back over here. <laughs> yeah, this is tedious. Wow, I was actually being kind of stupid for the past couple of minutes. But yeah, we can go in this door now because this... I'm freaking it's not like Super Paper Mario for you all to quickly enter the door. 
So yeah, we're coming across a new room. Uh, these these dry bones don't seem to do anything. There's another door over here which we can do this. Oh, hello. And we're gonna perform a force strike over here. And we'll kill him in one hit. Oh, I should probably go kill that Koopa Troopa in the back. Um, I think I'm gonna do a multi bounce. Okay. I think we're gonna do a power shell because there's two of them. That only did one damage, that's really bad. Dang it. <sighs> ah, dang it. I tried to get the super card this time. Eh, it didn't work. I'm gonna do another multi bounce. Just so that it could knock him off. Or... I can't even do a freaking. Stylish. Doesn't seem like he can get up, so I'm gonna go do a normal drum. Okay, stylish. Double cross. It's still down to 1 HP. Oh, seems like it got back up, so we get to still normal drum. Ah! Stylish. For another 5 star points. Uh, we're not very close to a level up, unfortunately, so, uh, yeah. Okay, so I guess we could just take care of this guy. Oh, so there's uh, one of these guys, and then... I think I'm just gonna go with one girl. I should have probably attacked the one in the back, because that one had a power block. Uh, I'm gonna swap partner with the Bella. Surprised he didn't use this. Oh, surprised he didn't use the power block. Oh, you're gonna pay for it now. Dead. That's another four star point for the pocket. That gave us some HP back, which is nice, but I would have much preferred, uh. Okay. So this puzzle requires. Oops. Uh, so this switch right over here, that'll open up a grid over here. Uh, basically, what we can do is. With this grate. Okay. So we don't have anything. There's another loose dry bones here. What the heck? Hey, guess! It's been a long time since anyone came here! A real long time! Huh? You heard me? Wow! Wait a sec, if you can hear my voice, you must be some legendary hero or something. Or not. To be honest, I'm sure anyone with ears can hear me. But, sure is fun singing people with that whole legendary hero bit. <laughs> Mario just gets seriously surprised. Eh, hey, hey, but seriously, folks, I was wondering if you could let me out of this chest. I've been lodging here so long, starting to cramp up like you wouldn't believe. All you have to do is find the key and let me out. Easy. Huh? What do you mean? You think you'd be cur you'll be cursed if you open a box? Ridiculous. Who would do that, really? Wait, a wait in a box and curse folks? A real slime ball, that's for you. But I'm not a real I'm not a real slime ball, and I would do no such thing, but that should be obvious. Look, if you help me out, maybe I'll help you out. No, a little I scratch your bag, you scratch my accepted reverse sword. Of course, you don't have to, if you really don't want to, like finding a key is hard. So basically, what we need to do is go in this door. So we traverse through this, you'll want to memorize uh, where we go, as you can see there's holes on the ground, so that indicates that there's probably going to be spikes. So, I'm going to take a couple of seconds just to memorize what this formation looks like, because if I open this chest... I get a black key, and guess what? Spikes pop up. Um, Mario, look at that. Yep. Ceiling is cleft. Oh, I don't like the look of this. Come on, run. So, we only got a couple seconds to escape this room, so... It's a good thing I decided to memorize what this room looked like, so that I don't have to worry about, like, having to, like... Traverse through this, but any, but anywho, this this mission is stupidly hard, and we just got through in a breeze. Man, that was too close. Gotta shake it off. Whew. Okay, we got the key, so let's go open that spooky chest. So let's open this. We're gonna get a new ability. Hey there, boy! I'm so glad you found that key. Unbelievable. We <laughs> fools! And we got a new ability. It's funny is that this isn't even a curse, it's an ability. Why, the only, only the most idiotic pudding brain dolt would fall for a scheme like that. 
The castle's trash prevent anyone who's entered this place from ever leaving it. No matter which path you take, you're fated to waste away, you poor painful end. But wait, there's more to this great deal. I'll throw in a free curse! No charge! Googly googly boom! <laughs> now you're cursed, Doofus, and it serves you right. This curse is more cursedly curseworthy than any curse that's ever cursed you. Oh god. But this curse makes you like a piece of paper when you press and hold R. <laughs> what a curse. You curses like me? No one. Now, I shall show you just how frightful a curse it is. Go on, press and hold R. Okay. Press and hold R now. <laughs> just look at yourself. How embarrassing for you. Eat a sandwich, skinny. <laughs> Do you understand what this curse is for you? Yes. Then farewell, you dumbbells. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I love imitating that, but that's just, yeah. But basically, when we go back, we can use this new ability to our advantage. This is good. And we want to go in here. As you can see, you got attack FXR, change the sound effects on Mario attacks. We want to equip this. Now, of course, any kind of sound effect badge will always cause zero BP. So you don't have to worry about anything. So I'm just going to keep it. And if we go to this middle one right over here, as you can see, it's just a a static dry bones. <laughs> um, basically what we could do is head in here. Um, as you can see, uh, what we could do is go over here. Now, if we, if we did recall, we do have to do a little bit of backtracking right here because there is a key in, other, in one of the other rooms. So we're going to go ahead and do that. As you can see right here, there's a key, but we can't really access it through the paper ability. You have to go through from here. As you can see, this is the only alias where it's actually tall enough for us to actually enter through. So we go here, go down this corridor, get this key. We're gonna go... Okay, there's nothing here on the end, so we're just gonna go back. Go through that here. And then just kind of come out of here. So, it shouldn't be stupidly hard, but... You know, some things can be really confusing like I was when I first played this area. <laughs> I probably was stuck here for a couple hours the first time I was here. Now, my question is, is there really anything that... No, I don't think there is. So, we're just gonna abandon exploring this area for now. Now, we can save here. Uh, I am going to save right here. Yeah, as you can see, this alcove right there. So, we do this. Get on this block, let Coops hit the, the the block, the little block, and then we can head over here up these stairs. And if we head up here, as you can see, there is a there is a badge over here, but we can't really do anything about it yet. So we're just gonna go in this door and open this. Then there's a healing block, a health block if we need that, which we kind of do need. There's a star piece behind that window, as you could probably, you could kind of tell from like the glowing effect. Uh, so you hit this switch. To get this switch over here, you activate it with coops. So you activate a coops with this one. And as you can see, there's no third switch over here, but actually you notice that this window is open. It took me a while to figure this one out when I first played this. <laughs> star piece, that's also how you get the star piece back there. Wait, hold on. Okay, there's nothing. Okay, there's nothing behind the star piece. I would have wondered. Uh, let's keep going here. No, it doesn't seem like anything behind that either, so we're just gonna go jump out this window. And then please enter the door. There we go. Oh, another. That! Man, these enemies really want to. I'm going to hammer. And do a stylish move just because why not. Making progress in terms of level ups, but we're not really gonna. We're probably not gonna get a level up anytime soon, though. I believe these dry bones are. Yeah, these dry bones are static. Uh, these dry bones are kind of just there for aesthetic purposes, so we want to activate coops, activate this one with coops. Head up here. And we actually want to- Oh! <laughs> yeah, I could think that I was prepared for that. Oh, there's a Spike Goomba.
Oh, it's like Goomba gets hit by a. Oh no, I did not want to jump on that. So uh, yeah, another Goomba there. Now actually, I want to switch to Goombella. Now before I head in this door, I want to actually switch to Goombella. It's a really funny text coming that's gonna happen if I enter this door with Goombella. Huh? Oh my! Who's this handsome piece of cheese? I can't believe those are other thieves besides me. How very strange. Who? Who are you? Me? Why? I'm Miss Bowles, the globe trotting thief. Heard of me, sweetie? I heard there were rare, valuable badges here in this castle. That's why I'm here. But the real question is, why are you people like you roaming in such a rundown place? I'll tell you why, Miss Ugly Pink, Pink Shoe, un whatever thief. We're here to be Hooktail. And just so we're clear on this, we set our sights on the Crystal Star before you, okay? Crystal Star, you say? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I didn't know a thing like that was hidden in this castle, so that's intriguing. Perhaps I just heard something you didn't want me hearing. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Shoot. Oh, but that's okay. I mean, you were looking for the crystal, this Crystal Star first. And I already found the badge I was after, so I'll let you get the, your Crystal Star. Let us, let us, what's that supposed to mean? That's, <laughs> mm -hmm. it means I must say bye bye for now, Mr. QT. I know, it's sad, we just met it, and already it's time to say farewell, alas. Hey, hey, you little flirt, what do you think you are? Who do you think you are kissing Mario? Oh, I always forgot, I have a little secret to share with you. Somewhere in this castle is a badge that will help you beat best hook tail or so I've heard. I don't know what kind of badge it is, maybe you found it already, maybe not. If you're going to fight Hooktail, I recommend fighting that badge first. Well, take care, handsome mustard man, let's get together again real soon. <laughs> what is with that girl? What a flirt. Who acts so disgusting like that? <laughs> so we open this chest, we get a mushroom, which is nice because we used up all of ours. Got a castle key, and a honey syrup. And another Shine Sprite, so we got two of these now. Uh, when we look in our gear, as you can see, a Honey Syrup- Yeah, we have two Honey Syrups right now. And, yeah, obviously they restore FP, so we can head over here. Oh, we actually had to go this way. And I'm gonna jump on you because... I'm gonna Stylish. That's how you get the stylish for Gumbella. Yeah, so Gumbella, you get the press before you jump, and then you'll perform a spin at midair. So yeah. Oh, so it turns out you actually did have to go this way. Cancel key, head in here, get in this over. Oh, another dry bones. Wow, there's, wow, there's a lot of dry bones in this castle! <laughs> Die. Yeah, I'm die. Oh, come on, really? So unless I screw this up, I should be able to take out that coop. There we go. Oh my god, this guy's spawning reinforcements. Oh. That doesn't seem like I really do anything with Gumbella, so I'm just gonna cut that. I could slap my partner, but I don't feel like it, so... I'm just gonna hammer you to destruction. At least we get more star points from that, so we got another 8 star points, so that's 63. So let's just grab these coins. Hello there. Oh, come on, really? Oh, there we go. That was super guard. That was a super guard.
Then we might as well just take these guys, uh... Ow. I'm gonna hammer. Might as well. Uh, actually, I don't think it would matter. For the moment. There we go. Another six star points, so we're at 69. Cool. And we're gonna take out this driver lens, because we might that might get in the way. Oh god, it's four of them. They're stylish. I definitely want to take out that Koopa Shrimp in the back. I'm gonna do a power bounce on that one. Ah, dang it. Oh well. At least I took it out. I'm gonna just kill the Koopa because... Is that Koopa in the back out of foul block? Ah, oh, dang it. That dry bone's really... It's not reinforcements. Um, so I'm gonna hammer... I probably should have taken out the Koopa Shrimp first. Oh, what? Come on, really? I didn't have any time to react. Okay, I'm just gonna jump on this Koopa. I don't know how many your turns they would act. Oh, really? There we go. 13. Pretty good. 82 already? Well, wow. okay. I definitely didn't want to heal up at certain Oh, we got a power block. Cool. Uh, get this. Oh, I need coops. Can I please get my Sato coops? There we go. So I do this. We head on this block. Oh, there's a star piece over there, so... What we want to do is... You want to get in here... And then... And I come out here. I'm being very kind of kind of be cautious here. The star piece right over here. I'm gonna do this. Make sure I'm only pressing. Okay. Now and then I turn. Wait, hold on. Let me just check to make sure there's nothing. There's nothing on the left. No, there's nothing. Cool. Okay, cool. There's nothing. Uh. There we go. Plane. There we go. So enter this door. As you can see, there's a block right over here. We can use Koops to grab this, but more importantly, we can get this. We can get this. Oh, I don't have... Oh, well. And I can probably level myself up enough, so I'm going to go back... Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna replenish on HP, replenish my HP, and then I'm going to, um, yeah, I'm just gonna keep backtracking back, uh, over here. Oh, this is gonna be a little bit of a tedious thing, so... Did I seriously just mess up? I knocked Koops the wrong way. <laughs> oh well. Oh well. Eh, it shouldn't be too bad to, you know, do the thing. I just need to do this door. Alright. So just keep backtracking. So we just... Can I please just... This shouldn't be too bad. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and uh... I like to stand on the edge just so that I have the most space. 
Okay, there we go. And now we can head up here. And yeah, uh, I feel like I might have missed something back there. Hold on. Never mind. You know what? I'm just gonna probably come back here. Probably off. I'll probably come back here off screen, and then I'll re grab the thing. So I'm just gonna dodge these enemies because I kind of just want to send the episode right now. But I'm gonna go ahead and see if I could like. So I'm gonna keep going up these stairs. So go up this ramp to the tower. Um, so I'm gonna keep traversing up this thing. Oh, what battle? Okay. Yeah, apparently there was a thing here. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, go my hammer. I want to get rid of this one because that one has a sleepy sheep and that's never a good thing. Ah, dang it. Oh, there we go. Got the... Yeah. Oh no, that's not good. Oh no, that's not good. Um, can I swap partners? I can. I can. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, let's use a normal hammer on this guy. Dang it. I think I need to jump on this. Nine star points, so we're pretty close to a level up, but we're not there quite yet. Okay, whatever. Um, as you can see, there's a health block and a save block right here, but and I'm free, which probably means there's a boss door here. So we're actually gonna end this off right over here. So if you guys enjoyed this episode, be sure to leave a like because leave a like and, sus and subscribe because uh, that would greatly help appreciate the channel. I appreciate it because. That would greatly help the channel. So, without further ado, well, it is. It is what it is. See you guys next time. On Paper Mario, the Thousand Year Door.